Turner Classic Movies has partnered with the Chicago Film Archives to broadcast eight films from the Film Group collection. The rarely screened documentaries offer a window onto the civil rights movement of the 1960s, with a specific focus on the unrest that took place in Chicago during the 1968 Democratic National Convention. Most delegates to this convention do not know that thousands of young people are being beaten in the streets of Chicago. The film group began making social documentaries after its commercial film crew witnessed police violence during the 1968 protests. The crew started filming the events unfolding before them, and that eventually led to an educational series called The Urban Crisis and the New Militants. The ideology of the Black Panther Party is uh, pretty much the ideology of, of the masses of black people. You know, we only offer forth what black people want, you know, and what they've been crying for for a long time. And uh, that is to have complete freedom. In this film, called Black Moderates and Black Militants, members of the Black Panther Party sit down with an African-American principal. I have my doubts. I understand you what understand you mean, but as long as you work within a framework of what is existing now, I think you'll always run into a hang-up because, you see, the thing is we're about changing what exists now, you know, by whatever means necessary, including revolution, you know. In addition to these shorter works are two outstanding feature-length documentaries, American Revolution II and The Murder of Fred Hampton, which looks to the life and tragic death of the charismatic 21-year-old Black Panther leader. So we say, we always say in the Black Panther Party that they can do anything they want to us. We might not be back. I might be in jail. I might be anywhere. But when I leave, you can remember I said with the last words on my lips that I am a revolutionary. And you're going to have to keep on saying that. Tonight's documentaries on TCM provide a vital and fascinating historical context to more recent social and political unrest. Beth Accomando, KPBS News.